Hi guys, I have something sweet to share with you today. And this is going to be our, our visual when it comes to using the rolled in embouchure. Actually, one of my students came up with this and we've been using it for oh, almost a semester now. And it's been helping a lot, especially with uh, some of my trumpet players and uh, trombones that have braces. And this is really neat. I'm gonna share it with you. And if it works, great. If it doesn't, forget it. But we're going to liken the embouchure to one of these sandwich cookies, where the rolled in is the outside of the cookie, the hard part, and the inner part of the lip is the cream filling. So just like this cookie, the outside here is nice and firm and protects it, and the center is really, really soft. Of course, you know, this is always the fun part when you take them apart. Oh. So that is soft, and this is what we have to protect, because if you don't protect it, see, that's what happens. So the outside of the cookie protects the inside, just like our embouchure, where the outside of the lips are going to roll in slightly to protect them. But, just like the cookie, you can still use too much pressure and some other devices and you can start crumbling the cookie. So this does protect, but you still have to be wary about it. But the nice thing is that my students have found is when they visualize their lips like this, rolling in, keeping it firm, but keeping the cream filling here soft and it allows the air to come through it, then it's easy to duplicate. They can visualize it. They can put it together. And the sound seems to open up because they're not trying to tense too much of this and make it too tight because they're envisioning this because they only need the tension here to give it protection and then the center nice and soft like this Nice and soft right there. So I hope that makes sense. And of course, the best part about this demonstration is when you're done, you get to have the cookie. Hey guys, have a good day. Thanks.